Hello. Today I'd like to show you how I do some more of my uh, basic free motion quilting by machine. And I today I'll show you how I do the meandering plus some other shapes included as you go. Um, in this case I'm going to do some hearts, completely free motion in amongst the meandering. So I've got my um, fabric, a sample today, and I've got um, batting in between. And the batting I'm using is a heat resistant batting because I'm going to turn these samples into um, pot holders. I've set my machine up, I've dropped the feed teeth and I've got a free motion foot on my machine which will allow me to manoeuvre the fabric around when the foot presser bar is down. That foot allows you to slide your fabric around because that's how you create the movement of the free motion. You're creating your own stitch length as you go so don't think that the stitch length on your machine will make a difference because in this case it won't. So just starting somewhere perhaps down one of the sides. I'm basically meandering but I'm going to include some hearts as I go. And here's a heart. And I'll continue on with my meandering. see that as I think of it I can just include another little heart shape they're very free form hearts um, we're not trying to go for perfection here this is just part of the quilting to make it a little bit more interesting So I would um, choose a shape that you're um, comfortable with, such as a heart um, or a star or some shape, a leaf shape maybe, something that's fairly simple to start off with. creating the shape as you go it's like drawing with your sewing machine needle so you have to imagine that the needle is your pencil my sample with meandering plus with these little hearts scattered throughout and how pretty would that be if you had stars or you might have leaves or something else like that in there um, it's going to look much the same on both sides and that's about it for today thank you